television, the drug of a nation, in a nation of drug takers. Are we ruled by television, or are we simply trapped in... Hello? Is anybody out there? Perhaps we should take a step back outside the square, or set, that is our television. Consider this. What if you'd never, ever set eyes on a television set? Would you be truly free? Is Abdullah Fattah truly free? For he has never set eyes on a television set. No, but I have experienced television. So, so you have seen television before? Yeah, yeah, at a really young age. Uh, my parents just let me sit in front of the television for hours a day. And then after a, um, a really bad... Uh, episode of Dallas, I was forced basically to go into a detox at the uh, Daryl Summers Clinic, yeah. So you're a reformed TV addict? Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. I, f I think I'm, I'm, I'm a more whole person because I have experienced television and now I experience not television. So it's kind of a religion? Well, a spiritual philosophy. So what would you like to say to the people? Um, I think I just want to let everyone know out there that, that television is really bad and that if we don't stop it now, we're just going to end up just destroying ourselves and, and our children's. Pretty morbid message. Well, it's a pretty morbid world. Abdullah Fattah, victim of a spiritual upbringing or merely a man with a valid point. Brian Watt, on the other hand, is in a world of his own. Brian Watt's life is completely dedicated to television, as is his home. Self-contained and totally devoted to his one true love. Tell me, Brian, why do you love television so much? There's just nothing else that can offer that much. Brian, how important is television to you, and could you live without it? Most definitely not. I, I couldn't live without it. There'd be no reason to go on anymore. I hear that Neighbours has inspired you to make some films of your own. Can you tell me about those? Yes, yes. Um, I took the surrealist elements and the Dave elements. I took it all and I spliced it all together. And I made what Hollywood would call nothing. I think, I think there's aliens out there. Everyone everywhere is somehow watching us. There are some people who have argued that television is chronically bad for you. What would your answer be to them? Um, this is obviously not true. I am utterly normal. There's nothing different about me. Then why are you wearing a dress? I'm not wearing a dress. Brian Watt. We thought it would be interesting to discover what would happen if Abdullah and Brian were immersed in the iconography of television. I bought our two television subjects here today to a secret television location somewhere in Melbourne to test their reaction on how television and locations such as this have affected their lives. Where are we? Heaven! Oh! Where are we? Harold! Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm home! Blessed be God! I'm in heaven! It's real! It's real! I love it! I'm here! <laughs> it's happening again! <laughs> You're not taking me away, are you? We're not leaving. We didn't come here for nothing. I've got to build a house. I've got to marry. Have kids. I've got a pet donkey. 